Hello, everybody. Um, health is about sports, but sports, I mean, if you think about soccer or go for skiing, um, there's also a certain risk that you have an injury. And one of the typical injuries in the sports which I just mentioned are ACL, anterior crucial ligament, or in German, um, Vorderes Kreuzband risk. So the one or the other might have heard or know somebody who had such kind of disease, such damage, and after some uh, support by the doctors, uh, you need to go for rehab. And the company, iSense, which I'm uh, introducing within the next 30 seconds, are um, having um, a solution, a typical IoT solution, which they're going to present, which I find very attractive. The three core guys are coming from Poland just uh, two and a half hours away from here, from Pozna. They study together um, different engineering subjects, and two of them um, worked then since the study uh, on different uh, topics, for example, on, on sensors for smart drones, the small ones. Obviously, this business for drones is going to be impacted more and more by big manufacturers, so they went for the area of medical device, which is a bold step, actually. And, uh, but they were successful so far, as we can say, they won a prize from the uh, from uh, from Poland Impact uh, Impact Poland, yeah. So, so a small ac uh, accelerator and got some money over there. We're able to develop their product for the first level, and during the course of this um, this circle here, this accelerator, they came to the second level of the product. They recently even received enough money to uh, go for production on a first level and now have the idea on going for uh, registration, CE marking, which is actually coming from an area where you need some hardware. So they need software and hardware, obviously. Having enough money at the current step of development uh, for having their minimum viable product with, the, with this money is a huge thing. So what are they looking for now and which I would like you to take uh, to see positively uh, in, on the next things. What they are looking for now are partners in the area of sales and marketing for different countries, so basically first trials for distribution, or, and I am, there are some bigger companies who are in the area of um, not endoprocesses, the other way around, so orthesis is this called, where um, they are also talking to. So if you know people from this field, I think this is really a high shot which is uh, having an interesting solution. And therefore, let me ask to stage Adam Wozniak to introduce iSense to you. Thank you very much for the introduction. Thank you. Hello, I'm representing iSense Company, and we are developing smart sensors for telerehabilitation. I would like to tell you a bit today about effectiveness in physiotherapy. Imagine that you are injured. Certainly, each of you would like to recover as quick as possible. But how to do this at your home when you are exercising alone? You have to care about effectiveness. After consulting with several physiotherapy clinics, we have identified the problems with patients. They are not exercising, but if they do, they are not doing it properly. So often, they are worse in their condition. We'd like to solve this problem using new technologies. Let me introduce you our smart sensors for telerehabilitation. Our product consists of sensors and mobile app. We developed a breakthrough sensors, very accurate, which paired with our mobile app, allow patients to get the feedback about accuracy of their movement during exercises in their homes. To use our sensors, you just need to put them directly to your body or using your orthopedical equipment, and that's all. After connecting with your smartphone, we are able to give you a feedback in real time about accuracy of your movements. We are measuring angles, velocity, and acceleration. So with our sensors, patients are able to exercise safely and effectively anywhere and anytime, and we can ensure them that they, are, that they are safe at their homes. Our product have also another component. It's a telemedicine platform. 
to ensure patients that somebody is watching. I mean physiotherapist. He's able to get an access to the data and change something if it's necessary. We researched most common types of injury, injuries and developed a product which can be applied in most rehabilitation scenarios in all age groups. But now we are focused on new rehabilitation. There are 4 million patients with this kind of injury every year globally. We would like to speed up recovery using our measurements, our feedback, personalized uh, therapy. We would like to improve effectiveness so finally people, their patients will be able to recover as quick as possible. Yeah, we are now in some validation process. We start some tests with hospital in Poland. We've got more than 1,000 measurements from 60 patients uh, in cooperation with five uh, physiotherapists, and we've got really nice feedback about our sensors, about user experience and user interface. We are assuming a subscription fee for every week of renting our sensors with app access, but we are also planning to develop a product directly, the professional product directly for hospitals and private clinics. Of course, we've got some competitors, but our sensors are, are much more accurate than image processing app, for example, based on Kinect or and other sensors. Of course, you can also buy some sensors technology, but it costs more than 45,000 euro, and you have to have PhD to start using it. So we are we are providing our product directly to the homes of the, of, of the patients. We would like to make a simple uh, a physiotherapy, not, not much more harder. We carefully researched the market, and the market will double in the next two, three years based on KPMG report. So it's very important for, a young, for, for us as a young company. Yeah, after Few months since we established our company, we are after accelerating program in Poland. We've got some funds from them, and we start production process. We've got first batch of 60 sensors. We've got MVP of our mobile app, which is now testing in hospital. We've got CMARC for electronics, and we start negotiating with few big companies from the industry about some pilots and some some future projects. And we are planning to certify our solution as a medical device, class 2A, in next, to, uh, in next year. Of course, we need uh, some funds to do this. We already acquired uh, 500,000 euro from VC in Poland, and we are looking for another, another 500 for some sales and marketing activities in whole Europe. We can differentiate our revenue streams, we can also apply, our sensors can be applied in, for example, sport, sport industry, but now we are focused on medical industry. After that, we will validate some, uh, some other markets. In last year, we have built a team with all necessary competences. My, co my friends, which are also co-founders, are responsible for hardware and the software. Piotr is responsible for sensors, I mean electronics. Uh, Jarek is responsible for algorithms and the firmware, which is very important to this, uh, to this business, to this case. We also got some team members which are uh, consultants in, in medical, and they've got also an experience in sales and marketing. So we've got a complete team to uh, get into the market. So let's speed up recovery using our sensors. Thank you very much. Thank you.